early Saturday morning, September 3rd, surveillance cameras outside the Irish Bread Pub captured the last known images of Yolanda Brown. You see her walking out of the pub, then later on, you see her leave the parking lot before vanishing into thin air. It's never like my mama to cut her phone off. Never. She loves her kid, her grandkids. She loves her family. Behavior, Ms. Brown's family says, leads them to believe something bad has happened to her. She doesn't disappear ever for this amount of time. Mickey Newtall believes her sister met someone at the pub Friday night. She doesn't meet strangers. She always wants to be someone's friend. I just want somebody, anybody, to figure out where my sister is, whatever the outcome. The family of Yolanda Brown has received confirmation from law enforcement officials that the remains found in the vehicle in Newton County are that of 53-year-old Yolanda Brown. This is not the outcome they were hoping for, yet the family is grateful for the community's support and outpouring of love they have received during this difficult time. The family also wishes to thank law enforcement agencies for their diligence in searching for and locating their loved one. The family asks for your continued prayers and privacy while the investigation into the cause of her death is conducted. It is very difficult to not know the circumstances surrounding her passing, yet they are hopeful that answers will be forthcoming in the weeks and months ahead as the investigation continues. The family asks that if anyone has any information that may be pertinent to the investigation, no matter how small, that you share it with law enforcement. The family is grateful for the continued support. Within the last hour, 11 Alive has confirmed a body discovered earlier this week is 53-year-old Yolanda Brown. The Covington mother was last seen leaving a bar near Hartsfield Jackson International Airport on September 3rd. Her body was found on Monday in a wrecked car in a wooded area of Covington. Brown's family believes that she met someone at that bar, leading to something bad happening to her. Soon after her disappearance, Yolanda's sister reached out to the community hoping for answers. I just want somebody, anybody, to figure out where my sister is, whatever the outcome. Now, we're being told by the Newton County Sheriff's Office that Brown's family has already been contacted and are still calling this an active and ongoing investigation. Tragic update in Newton County tonight. Authorities confirm a body found inside a car off I-20 this week is Yolanda Brown. The 53-year-old mother disappeared after leaving a Hapeville bar on September 3rd. Her body was found on Monday in a wrecked car close to Covington. Right now, police are still calling this an active and ongoing investigation, but they say they aren't saying if her death was suspicious. The Newton County Sheriff's Office confirms the body found in a car earlier this week is Yolanda Brown. The 53-year-old disappeared September 3rd. She was last seen leaving the Irish Bread Pub on Virginia Avenue in Hapeville. Her family was so worried. Officers found the car Monday with a body inside on I-20 near Alcovey Road in Newton County. And again, they've confirmed that the body found in the car is indeed Yolanda Brown.